everybody. Welcome to Doing Dental School. My name is Kajal Khatri. I am a first year dental student at Marquette University School of Dentistry and I am on spring break right now, which normally I don't really show much of my life outside of dental school. I usually kind of just film when I'm at school, um, but I'm home for the week. I'm not really doing much over spring break. I really just wanted to like come home, relax, not really do anything. I know my family kind of was like, oh, we should go somewhere. And I was like, no, I just want to stay home. Like, I just want to sit at home, be able to relax, be able to just like catch up. My parents just moved. And so I have a lot of boxes that really need to be like unpacked. And I, this is like, one of the first times I'm staying in my room. So I have a lot to unpack here too um, and just organize my room. So I really wanted to just take time to do that over spring break and then also just take time to relax. So I don't know how long this vlog is gonna be, but I figured that I would start filming today. Today's Monday of spring break and just got out of the shower as you can tell and I showed a little bit. I just like worked out this morning. And in a little bit, my dog needs to go and get his nails clipped and get his ears cleaned. So we're gonna take him to this new place and we actually wanna just like check out this place. So my mom and I are going there. And then later this afternoon, I have a doctor's appointment and my sister's currently in Chicago. So I'm just gonna go pick her up from the train station. So that's kind of the plan for today, but we'll see um, what all this week has in store for us. It has honestly been such a relaxing afternoon. Um, after this morning, just going and getting my dog's nails cut and his ears cleaned, um, we, my mom and I went for a walk and then I had some time to sit down. I tried to make a new um, like YouTube channel art banner. So I think I did it. I think I have it up, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I like it or if I want to change it a little bit, so we'll see. Um, I'm also trying to make a new YouTube intro because I've had the same one since I like started doing YouTube about like a little bit over a year ago, so I'm trying to just like revamp my whole channel. So I was doing that for a bit, ate some lunch, and now I'm here at my doctor's office. I'm gonna go in, I think it'll be really quick. I'm pretty sure I'm just getting a shot and like that's it. Um, so hopefully that'll be quick. And then as I said, I'm gonna go and pick my sister up from the train station later today. Um, she's it's like three o'clock right now. I think her train comes in at 4 45. So in the in-between time, I might just go to like Target. I have a few things to grab from there and just browse around because that's I don't know I feel like the target like by my house is like the one that's my favorite because I love the layout like that's the one that I'm used to so I love coming to target when I'm home so um that is basically what I'm gonna be doing probably for the rest of the day um could I have a grande cold brew with um toffee nut syrup and vanilla sweet and cold foam Okay, that was literally like the quickest doctor's appointment ever. I think it took like total five minutes. Um, so it's kind of nice. We were in and out of there pretty quick and I went to Starbucks. I was really craving a cold brew. I have been for the past few days, just like a Starbucks cold brew. Um, so I went and grabbed that and a little change of plans now. My dad called me and said he was actually near downtown anyways. So he's gonna go and pick up my sister from the train station. So I have a little extra time, which is kind of nice. Um, so I'm gonna stop by, I'm here at half price books it's like my happy place um if you've watched some of my other videos you know that i really love reading this is something that i've kind of like really gotten into since last summer um and so I love like any books. I have so many books that I still need to read, but I feel like it's my happy place to go to the bookstore and look at books. So I'm going to go do that. And then I'll go to Target after that because I still do need to pick up a few things. So we'll um, make that the plan for the rest of the day. Tuesday of spring break. I did kind of the same thing this morning. Just woke up kind of later than normal. I usually like when I'm at school, I literally wake up at like between 5.30 and 6 every day. So waking up at 8.30 or 9 is 
kind of crazy for me, but um, today, again, not too much going on. My sister is getting her wisdom teeth out today, so that'll be fun. I'll probably go with her. Um, I think she needs to stop by the grocery store too to grab like mashed potatoes and applesauce and stuff like that that she can eat afterwards. Um, I know like I went to the same oral surgeon when I got my wisdom teeth out and I was fine that day. Like I was hanging out with my friends that day. So I think she'll be fine, but definitely having those foods is definitely important. But this morning I have a few hours still. So I think I'm going to do some like self care. I just got out of the shower. Um, so I actually have this new whitening, this tooth whitening kit. Um, it's called Aura Glow. And honestly, I don't usually like whiten my teeth that often. Um, I've done it like once, I think, but haven't done it very often. I think just because I don't have the time to actually like go to the dentist and do it, even though I'm in dental school, of course, but it takes a lot of time. And as a dental student, I don't have that time. So I figured having this would kind of be nice. Um, so I'm going to try to do this and then also um, maybe like do a face mask or something like that. This is all stuff that I don't get time to do when I'm in school. So now that I'm on spring break, might as well do that. All right, so I'm going to open this up. The packaging is like adorable. Um, so it's one of those teeth whitening kits that have, oh my gosh, can't even get it out. Well, this is what it looks like when you open it, but it has that LED light, which is kind of cool. Um, so it has a little one and I think it's only, you keep it on for 30 minutes, so not too bad. And I can always like keep it on when I'm sitting at school too, which is kind of nice. So I'm gonna follow the directions and try to do that. Okay, so I just got done whitening my teeth and getting my face mask off. So I felt very like rejuvenated and ready to take on the day. But um, I don't know if you guys can tell, but I can definitely tell a difference um, in my teeth. Like they definitely look a lot whiter. It might be in my head, but I definitely think so. I'm also going to use it for a few more days and a few more treatments just to like really get the effects of it. Um, one of the things that I really like about it is that it has like no sensitivity, which is always why I think I've been afraid also to um, go and wipe my teeth with like strips and stuff like that because I know that a lot of people say that their teeth really hurt after that but there's like absolutely no sensitivity like my teeth totally feel normal right now which is really nice um but yeah if you guys want to try aura glow out i have a code it's kajal 15 it'll get you 15 percent off of your entire order which is really nice and pretty good deal so um i will leave like a link down below you can use that and use the code kajal 15. I think we're going to head over to Myers into the grocery store so that we can go grab some wisdom teeth friendly foods um, so that my sister can actually have stuff to eat today and the rest of the week. Wednesday. Um, I feel like I'm always literally just catching you in the bathroom. I think just because like even when I come home like I just want to spend time with my family and we're just like always downstairs doing random stuff and just chit-chatting and so the only time I really get alone is like in my room but I'm like getting ready and stuff like that so sorry for all of the bathroom clubs but yesterday I don't even think I like talked to you until or like since the morning time but literally just relaxed my sister didn't get out her wisdom teeth she's doing fine we like went to Myers and I was just like sitting at home for a long time just like finishing some random work I edited a video that's going up 
Um, I made like new intros, outros, and like channel art. So that was a lot of work. <laughs> um, and then I'm working on an Instagram post for my Instagram. So a lot of like random work that I finished yesterday. Um, in the evening time, we were just like sitting, chit chatting. We were eating dinner. Um, we, me and my boyfriend are watching Love is Blind the second season um, because we've heard so much about it. Actually, I've heard so much about it. I'm just, he's just watching because I want to watch it. But, um, so we watched that in the evening time. So yeah, it was pretty like a relaxing day. And then today I'm actually shadowing. Um, so a lot of, like when I was at school, I was kind of just like longing to actually go and shadow a dentist just I don't know, to spark that like inspiration again. I think it always reminds me of like what I'm working towards. And yeah, seeing like the D3s and D4s definitely is inspiration, but I think going to an actual like dentist and seeing their practice and seeing how they um, do their work every single day is just very inspiring for me. So I'm gonna go um, just from like noon to four. This is the dentist that I always shadow. They're like always so happy to have me back. So <laughs> I'm kind of excited to go and just like ask some questions and see some cool stuff it was funny like when i called to ask to shadow he um the lady on the phone she was like oh like what day works for you next week and i was like well do they have anything cool going on like what's the coolest day <laughs> that i could come and shadow stuff um because i just like wanted to see some more exciting stuff that i normally like wouldn't see so um she said that wednesday afternoon they had some pretty cool stuff going on i'm not really sure what they have going on but i'm excited to see <laughs> also as you saw this morning um i did whiten my teeth again this morning um like did another treatment um i think the pack comes with like 20 or something like that but i wanted to say like i'm definitely seeing a difference i'll insert i took like a photo yesterday and then a photo today of like after two treatments and it's crazy like i showed it to my parents and my sister and it was like it's kind of insane how much of a difference it makes and i know that whitening your teeth like is a confidence booster and i see that in so many people but i've never tried it myself and it is so much of a confidence booster like i am looking in the mirror and i'm just like smiling because my <laughs> smile looks so white right now so yeah i really really like it and yeah, just to be like completely transparent i'm not being paid to say any of this um they did send me like the oracle product for free but and they gave me like a code to share with my followers but i'm not getting paid to say any of this definitely my honest opinions i definitely see a huge difference um so yeah okay also i've shown clips here and there of me reading um but i wanted to share i'm reading the guest list on my ipad right now um and that is the asda book for this semester like for marquette asda we kind of voted and chose the guest list by lucy foley it's definitely a different book than i would normally read i normally gravitate towards like romance and um kind of like especially like colleen hoover books i love her books um so this is different because it's a little bit more of like a thriller it's like a murder mystery type of thing but it's actually really good i definitely really like it i would highly recommend if you're looking for a book to read and then i have like a bunch of other books i think my goal is to finish this i'm only like I don't know, like 110 pages in um, out of 300, but I'm hoping to finish it over spring break and start another book. Um, I have a few that I do want to read. I have, um, here I can show you, I have Verity by Colleen Hoover, which I've heard from so many people is so good. I like bought this during, I think it was like Christmas time. Um, and I still haven't read it. And then I also have The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo, which I definitely want to read as well. So those are the two that I'm kind of like debating. I also have The People We Meet on Vacation. I feel like that's more of like a beach read type of thing. So probably going to wait until the summer to read that. Okay, so I just got out of shadowing and I am so happy that I went and that I went and just shadowed for a bit. I was kind of debating it at first because I was like, you know, at I'm always surrounded by dentistry when I'm at school and so this should be my break from dentistry, but I'm really glad I went because it gave me a good idea of just like what dentistry is like in the real world and sometimes you forget that even though I shadowed so much as a as a pre-dental and as an undergrad, I shadowed, I spent so many hours at this club, at this um, office just shadowing, but it was nice to just go there and see. Now that I know a little bit more, it was cool to see 
just how they work and their workflow especially also like you know when i'm assisting at school it takes like three to four hours to do a prep or it takes um i don't know like next week i'm doing a profi on one of my classmates and it's gonna take like four to five hours to do a profi which at a normal clinic it does not take that long so it's kind of nice to just see the workflow and ask a bunch of questions now that I actually know a little bit more so it was really nice and I'm very very happy that I went and just learned a little bit um but yeah now um there's a pick and save which is a grocery store right across from this clinic and so I'm just gonna go in and grab a few things and then I think later tonight we're actually going to get in the hot tub it's super nice today it's like almost 70 degrees i think the high is like 66 so i'm it is like super 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 nice and i'm really excited because i feel like i always thrive when it's just a little bit warmer outside even though i live in wisconsin so um i'm gonna go into pick and save grab a few things and then hopefully we can get in the hot tub tonight on my car while I'm driving so hopefully this stays but um, I'm currently on my way to go and meet a friend from high school just for lunch um, her and I usually just like always during our breaks we will always get together and it's one of those friends that like I don't talk to every day we don't text every day nothing like that but like when we get together we can talk for hours like it's like no time has passed which is always the best type of friendship um, and you know that it's a true friendship so really excited to go see her but I kind of just want to hop on and like chat a bit um I think yesterday I was kind of just like feeling a little down and I think it's just because spring break is like kind of coming to an end it's Thursday right now so I still have a few more days but I think I always feel like this during every single break no break ever seems like long enough I remember even during Christmas break and during Thanksgiving and even like over the summer I remember like I just have a lot of like anxious feelings going back to school and I think it's just because I know oh you guys are definitely slipping um, I think it's just because I know that when I go back like this is what's gonna happen. Like I know next week is Two already miles. a really Take busy exit week. And, not to um, I know that I, I have a few exams the next week and I know that right when I get back, like we just hit the ball rolling. And I guess the nice thing is, is that I do have about like one break every single month until August or like September. So the fall semester, which is kind of nice to know. It's like a little, just, I don't know, like my little saving grace in the back of my mind. But I don't know, I just, wanted to share that because I feel like other people probably feel that same way of like you come home and you're so excited for spring break and then it's over in like a flash of an eye like you just blink and it's done and I don't know it just feels like no time off is enough of a break from school to just like truly just completely relax and I don't know if I'm alone in feeling that way but I think it's just all of those anxious feelings in the back of my head now of being like okay in like four days I'm gonna have to to start like taking exams and studying again like I have a quiz 8 a.m. the day that I Take go back exit. so so yeah it's a lot of just anxious feelings setting in but sign. hopefully the I can still enjoy the next Drive few days and kind of just enjoy the time off that I do have but but yeah I just got here and I think I'm just gonna end the vlog off here is just so that I can enjoy and relax for the next few days and just enjoy the last few days of my spring break but if you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and I hope you enjoyed the video. It's a little different for me because I usually just share my life of dental school, so it's a little different of actually just showing my real life. But I hope you enjoyed and make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed as well and subscribe down below. I'll see you next time. Bye.